In this video, we'll be showing you how to set up metallic effects within your artwork file on rostar.com. Let's begin. For metallic material, you'll want to separate your metallic effects from the rest of your artwork. As you can see, the template has pre-made layers. There is a metallic elements layer for your metallic effects, an artwork layer, and an FPO for placement only layer to represent the silver material. Keep in mind, you can always add more metallic and artwork layers if needed. For this design, we've chosen the header on the back panel and the faded stars on the front panel to be the metallic effects. To place those objects on the metallic elements layer, simply hold down the shift key and select each metallic element. Once all objects are selected, you can see in the Layers panel that there is a colored box to indicate selected art. Just simply click and drag the colored box onto the metallic elements layer. When that's complete, double check to make sure all intended metallic elements were moved by turning off and on the metallic elements layer. As you can see, we have successfully moved the objects. In this design, we are also indicating areas that will showcase the exposed silver material. By using the pre-made silver material layer, any elements and or graphics intending to be exposed silver material need to be seen through the artwork and should not be covered up or hidden. In this design, you'll see we have created the zigzag pattern to be part of the material that will be visible. Another way to indicate the exposed material is by using the pre-made spot color in the swatches panel called Exposed Material. In this design, we have filled the star in the Rostar logo with the Exposed Material color swatch, so we know the intention is for the material to show. We will then move the star to the metallic elements layer so all metallic effects are on the same layer. When the design is complete, Remember to outline all fonts by selecting all, then go to type and choose create outlines. Then embed any images by going to the links panel, selecting all images and choosing embed images from the drop down menu. Click OK to flatten layers to a single image for all. Then simply save the file as a high quality PDF by going to File, Save As, and choosing High Quality Print as the Output. And there you go, your artwork is ready for submission.